Hello guys, in this new video I will teach how to connect a generic gamepad like this that can we get in any store, in any place where they sell cell phones and all that. And so, it turns out that this type of device, those kind of controls, can also be connected to a computer. Considering that this is, especially for cell phones, ready, before anything, I am going to show you several suggestions on how, how to connect it and, and if you have any suggestions, leave me in the comments, that I will also make a second part, and I will also explain a little about how to calibrate, the controls, and if possible, well let's say configure it, depending on the game you have installed there, no more start, first we will need, as, cable, connect directly to the computer, and the control port, that in this case, there it is included, there as you can appreciate, the next step is, connect them, but, we are not going to connect this to the computer, now I'm going to teach you, and is that one has to hold down a button, that in this case, moment if I can detail it well, in this case it is the start button, but y'all can try with a sunk hold or any button that in this case I hold down the start button I connect. We connect our PC and it already detects us. So, we must wait for the drivers to be installed and all that is not required to install a program of more. Our next step if we want to configure our control, let's say in the most calibrated way possible, we will have Tander to control panel Search for Jugos o Buscamos Dispositivos Games or search for devices USB device setup A moment that from there I can detail them There as you can appreciate This is the name of that said function, we give it here It is possible that suddenly do not appear to us. So there it already detected us automatically. And then we are going to give options to. Sorry properties. And then we are going to load this. From there. We are going to calibrate. That I also have to show it here. As you can see, it will appear to us. The wizard lets go. To do the said calibration, which is obviously going to ask us for the central point. For those who don't know the main point, is normally the analog, the analog of the gamepad. In that case, we are always going to use this. Then we will simply sync it automatically. He is going to ask us to calibrate it. As and there as you can see. Then we give it next. A. Check center point which in this case, it is also agree let's say, to your preference, in this case of mine, well obviously, it's going to be the second button, that in this case the z-axis would be the right, so we give it next, and we locate and that's it, now if we want is to configure our control. We have to enter our favorite game. In my case, I'm going to enter Halo to game. That is going to load us there. A moment. Ready once there. Well, depending on the fire or emulator, or whatever you're going to set up, we are going to enter the fire settings. And there how you can see if you need to check. There how can you detail, there it is working correctly, in fact I'm going, right now I'm going to show you a gameplay, so, from there we will enter the part where it says, player well in the case of Halo to but itself, will appear in the control part, in game settings or settings, in this case, as you can see, there we can configure, our controls and all that, now, so that they can see that it really works.
There as you can see. They are just going to load the map and all that. So that they catch. Actually everything works. Yes let's change weapons. There I am sinking the trigger so that they get caught. And then nothing. If you liked the video, for any reason or if it helped you, give me a powerful like as you can see. Otherwise you can subscribe. Leave me in the comments if you have any new suggestion. And see you for the next one.